To make this relationship work, it will take love. This is the core of your marriage and why we are here today. It will take trust to know that in your hearts you truly want what's best for one another. It will take dedication to stay open to one another and to learn and grow together. It will take faith to go forward together without knowing exactly what the future brings. And finally, it will take a commitment to hold true to the journey that you both have pledged here today. Now, may your marriage grant you patience, tolerance, and understanding, as well as the passion and excitement every marriage should possess. May you support one another as a sign of mutual independence. May you continually rediscover your love in one another as the greatest gift of all. May you need one another, but not out of weakness. May you want one another, but not out of lack. May you look for things to praise, often say, I love you, 
and take no notice of small faults. May you have happiness and may you find it making one another happy. May you have love and may you find it loving one another. So, you've come before us today, expressed your desire to be made husband and wife, exchanged marriage vows and sealed those vows by the giving and receiving of rings. I therefore, by the power vested in me in the state of Washington, now pronounce you husband and wife. Oh, the whole thing's falling apart. You may kiss your bride. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. and Mrs. Stenzel.